Right guys, back for another Dokkan battle video and today we'll be showing off the physical Super Saiyan 2 slash 3 Goku. He is 55% um, full, level 10 links for me. As for skill orbs, uh, I have a level 3 in slot 2 for dodge. Um, sorry, level 3 in slot 2, I have a level 3 dodge in the silver slot and then a level 5 attack in the bronze slot. I would, if I have dupes, or if I did pull dupes for my physical Super Saiyan Goku, would give him a full additionals, but uh, I've just done this for now. Okay, uh, we'll just use the Bulma support. So we're going to hop into Sidra, the God of Destruction for Universe 9 with this team. Um, as for rotations, I'm going to put the Super Saiyan 2 slash 3 Goku next to STR Vegito, and it looks like we had, we have neither uh, STR Vegito's in slot 1, which sucks. So, as for rotations, uh, let's see. I feel like we gotta do this for now. Uh, I brought this guy along just because whenever we transform into this uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, we can then activate more links, but this is what we have for now. So, there will be no attacks for uh, Super Saiyan 2 slash 3 Goku to take, but that's fine. Start a turn defense is 119k. We have. Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, Saiyan Lineage, and then Fierce Battle Active. I'm hoping that these guys don't get smacked up. 204k, great. Uh, so we'll have to pop a Sensu B next turn. Again, this is just one of these badly designed units. And it sucks because they had the Para Para Brothers uh, in their back pocket. I.e. they knew that they were going to drop them the way they were, right? With the giving or providing buffs based on uh, where they are in the rotation in terms of collecting orbs. Are they the second unit in the rotation to collect orbs? Then they give these buffs. If they're the first unit in the rotation to select orbs or collect orbs, then they give these buffs, all right? So they goofed um, with that STL Goten and Trunks. Wow, you're taking a lot more than I was expecting. Okay, I'll skip that because again, we don't really need to see that. Uh, I think what we can do is we can keep Tech Ultimate Gohan on right. Oh, actually, no, we brought her along, so we might as well use her, right? So we'll just put Khalifa there in slot one. We'll have Gohan on this rotation. And then, yeah, STR Vegeta will give STR Vegeta those STR ups. Okay, so, so far things aren't actually looking that great. Uh, my intention is to uh, take him into this stage, which is a, which is a type neutral setting. Uh, and then I will probably take him into a type disadvantage stage. Uh, again, this is the difficult or the most difficult content right now for global. So I can't really test him uh, in something like the the ultimate red zone. But okay, but Gohan still took a lot of okay. <sighs> Sidra is being very annoying at the minute. I do actually want to see how much damage he take in his Super Saiyan 2 form. So maybe we don't transform immediately. Um in fact, that's probably what I'm going to do here. Well, uh, once this turn resolves, some good damage actually from SCR Vegito. I think we'll just wait before we transform. Okay, yeah. Uh, again, I want to wait. So we're going to pop a Sensu. Um, okay, so we'll give SCR Vegito the 18 key. That's fine. All right, so as for links now, uh, we have a lot of links active. Saiyan Warrior Race, Super Saiyan, the Saiyan Lineage. Experience Fighters, PFB, and then Fierce Battle. I'm just going to pull up his link set in terms of what that all means. So, um, same War Race is 10% attack. Super Saiyan is 15% attack. Experience Fighters is 15% attack. Wow, that's a lot of attack. So, already he's sitting at 40% attack. The Saiyan Lineage and PFB gives him two key each, as well as some attack and defense. So, uh, we're looking at what? Uh, four key... Quick Master is telling me 50% attack and the first battle is giving an additional 20% attack. So yeah, 4 key, 70% attack and then 10% defense. So yeah, that's why I started turn defense is looking a lot, lot better, 124k. Now as for this Goku, he does launch a guaranteed normal which has a 30% chance of becoming a super attack. And he gets 50% attack and defense when performing a super attack as well. So 124 multiplied by 1.5. Multiplied by 1.3, just based on the fact that he only super attacks once. We'll put him at 241k defense, which is very good for a 55% unit. Uh, in the ultimate red zone, that level of defense will probably get him smacked up, but this is not a Super Saiyan 3 form, right? Yeah, 3.43, a very good attack set from him. 
Uh, remember, this guy also has a medium chance to stun, but uh, you know, stunning is pretty much irrelevant in the uh, the God of Destruction event stage. Can we get an additional super, please? No. Okay. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's good enough though. Uh, double digits, right? Again, this God of Destruction. Uh, okay, yeah, Sidra, his SA stat is 613,000. So, 613,000 uh, minus 241, he would take uh, like 372k damage. But again, you don't work out uh, how much damage a unit takes just by, you know, simple uh, takeaway or subtractions, a better way to put it, right? Uh, there's other factors you have to take a look into, like a class advantage and other stuff like that, which someone had actually sent me a link to this on the Reddit. In fact, can I try and pull it up? We can try and work out very quickly how much damage he would take. Uh, that's not really going to do anything but fine there. Um, I think, actually, yeah, Super Saiyan through Goku as well will take enough damage for us to fall under the HP threshold for the uh, Super Saiyan 3 transformation. But uh, let's see. Uh, can I find... Yeah, okay, how does damage, or, yeah, how does damage work? Right. So type modifiers, type neutral, opposite class, that's correct. 1.15 multiplied, or 1.15 times. Uh, I'm a bit stupid, I don't really, I don't really think this is the best time to, to work all this stuff out. We, oh wow, we can transform with one of the fusion units. In fact, I think we are. I think I'll transform with the... F no, we'll transform with my Vegito because the friend has uh, higher defense in the Goku and Vegeta form. And then we'll transform into Super Saiyan 3 Goku here. Let's just let these uh, active skills play out. Okay, so there we got the transformations now. Uh, I don't know if I'll show this, but I did make a bit of a blunder. Uh, I transformed with STR Vegito first, and then, uh, you know, that completely negated the Super Saiyan through Goku's active skill. So I, I closed the app and made sure to do it correctly on the second time round. So we're going to keep physical Super Saiyan through Goku in slot two. I think that's the best way to go about it. Um, yeah, sure, we'll do this because again, we're at full health, so there's no need to heal with the same type orbs. Uh, let's see, can we get Vegito in 18 key? If we do this, that will drop the tech orbs I want them to, which is good. So, uh, physical Super Saiyan 3 Goku. In this form, he gets 200% attack and defense, as well as 3 key at the start of turn. He gets that same 50% attack and defense when performing a super attack, but he also launches two additionals, each of which have a medium chance of becoming a super. Uh, and then he gets... What a great chance to perform a crit for six turns from the start of turn, as well as an additional 50% attack when attacking. So, yeah, Super Saiyan Goku does hit very, very hard in this form. Uh, so, start of turn defense was 127 there. Uh, 127 multiplied by 1.5. Again, uh, the physical Super Saiyan Goku greatly raises attack and raises defense in one turn. So, for the you know for one turn as a super attack effect, he raises attack by 50% and then raises defense by 30%. Um, so again, post super attack, we'll be looking at 247k defense, uh, as long as he only super attacks once. So this, what was that? 4.7, 4.8. Again, this has a 70% chance to crit. Okay, I didn't crit. That's fine. Uh, that didn't crit either, I don't think. That was a crit. Can we get one more? No. Okay. Um, so that was, uh, I feel like, Super Saiyan through Goku at his bare minimum, but again... Uh, I have used this guy many times already. He just looks very impressive once he starts getting those super attacks going. Okay, wow, can you like not... Okay, I was going to say, can you not suck? But this is my... This is my STR Vegito, right? Just with one dupe, so... Uh, he is taking 20k, but I mean... <laughs> you know, he's doing a lot of freaking damage as well. Um, right, so we're going to try and, I think, stall with this rotation. I don't want to do too much damage here. Uh, let's... 
put... Yeah, we'll just keep Khalifa in slot 1. That'll give Gohan another stack. And we're going to miss a super attack with the kids. I don't really want them to super attack. They aren't really getting touched anyway in slot 3. So uh, we don't really need to be scared about that. I do want to see a bit of a before and after with Super Saiyan through Goku. Hopefully we can get him uh, in slot 1. Uh, but again, he's not primarily a slot 1 unit. He wants to be in slot 2 because he gets a lot of his defense when attacking or on super. I'll tell you one thing though, I am really, I, I am kind of upset that I didn't get the Int Margin Vegeta Dokkan Fest. Because like, I feel like you put Margin Vegeta in slot 2, you put Super Saiyan through Goku in slot, uh, sorry, you put Margin Vegeta in slot 1, and then you put Super Saiyan through Goku in slot 2, and like that's a rotation just to kill uh, and tank any damage, right? Because Margin Vegeta will work very well defensively in slot 1, and then Super Saiyan through Goku will clean up. Oh, okay, that... This sucks on so many levels because uh, if we do this, we, we are dead, right? Like, so I'm not going to do that. Um, that sucks. But, I mean, at least in slot 2, we get to see Super Saiyan 3 Goku with a lot more of his links active. We have everything active except Kamehameha. So, uh, we will not give them the 18 key. Again, I don't want them to finish Sidra off or do a lot of damage to Sidra. Again, solid turn defense is the same, 127. So, hopefully, we can get a few more super attacks in here. Okay, how much does this do? This shouldn't do too much. Yeah, 115 is not bad. I mean, honestly, it's like... <laughs> these got a destruction. Like, if you take the uh, the seventh year anniversary LR teams uh, into these stages, it's like they do a super attack, and it's like hardly any of your health gone. 4.9, so yeah, almost 5 million there, which is pretty impressive. I really like this guy's super attack as well. It looks really clean. Can we get a crit, please? Yeah, there's the crit. Yeah, this is when Goku starts looking a bit too absurd, right? Because again, this is 55%. Essentially, he's just done a 10 million attack stat. Uh, and that's not even factoring in his crit chance, which he crit on both of them. Um, yeah, this is pretty much a wrap. Yeah, okay. So uh, at this point, I think I'll move. We'll make a cut here and we'll go into a type disadvantage God of Destruction stage for uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Okay guys, so I've made my way to the God of Destruction for Universe 1, I1, I1, um, E1 I think is actually probably the, the best pronunciation for the name. And I'm actually going to float this guy off, I want him to be next to the SS3 Vegeta because they will share over in a flash uh, once I can get this guy to transform. So we're going to keep the rotation as it is and again I'll make a cut to turn 4 whenever we next see him. Uh, but as for Lynx right now, we have everything active but Golden Warrior, so that's... Uh, what, 4 key, 70% attack, and then 10% defense. So very, very powerful uh, buffs that we're getting through Lynx. Uh, we'll do this to open up the Tech Orbs there. I think Evolution Blue Vegeta will be fine as long as there's no super attack. <sighs> Thank you. Please dodge. Okay, that's a lot of freaking damage. It's fine. Uh, again, we do have the Bulma support memory, uh, as well as two Sensu Beans. Um, and again, I'm not really looking to do a no item run here. I think half Virus Goku should be fine. I'm expecting like 25k per normal, which again, uh, will be pretty good if he can live up to that. But uh, for all I know, he uh, he might be taking like 30 to 40k per normal, right? Attack stab is actually pretty good, again, considering this guy has a 59% chance to crit, which he did. Wow, he's taking double digits. Yeah, half Virus Goku is very good. Um, very, very good. Right, so yeah, 3.43. Now, a lot of people will look at that attack stat and be like, that's quite low. But remember, this Super Saiyan 2 form does have a 50% chance to crit, which he didn't crit. And he launches a guaranteed um, additional, which has a 30% chance of becoming a super attack. I'm, wow, I'm surprised that even after the, the double super, he was taking that much damage. But it's fine. Um, at this point, I think I'll make a cut until turn 4. So see you then. Okay, so now we've transformed it to Super Saiyan 3 Goku. We have every link active barring the Saiyan lineage. Starter turn defense is 121k. I will pop a Sensu Bean as well, just because there are many attacks in slot 2. I'm going to let this rotation play. If we die here, we die. I think I'm pretty satisfied with what we've seen uh, from Super Saiyan 3 Goku in the God of Destruction event. So again, 121k defense. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, again, the reason why I want to keep that in mind is just to calculate it. So... 
121 multiplied by 1.5, and now we just have to wait to see how many super attacks that uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku does chuck out for us here. I mean, I have seen it uh, two times at this point, uh, but he has quad supered, uh, you know, two times. So 5.1, uh, very impressive. Remember, 70% chance to crit. See you later. There's the crit. All right, here we go. If he starts doing this, he starts to look very, very broken. So we're now getting 60% defense from his super attack effect again, which is really impressive. Give me one more, please. Give me one more. Okay, so defensive level would have been at 300. And... Wow, it just took 560. Wow, that's crazy. Uh, but yeah, sorry, defense would have been 290k there. So we still took a lot of damage, but as you guys can see, uh, Super Saiyan 3, Goku, that, again, that was 55%. Uh, this guy with dupes is going to look a bit too powerful, right? Uh, and again, I think because of how much damage he's capable of doing, you can definitely warrant bringing him uh, in a type disadvantage scenario. So thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you guys think of Super Saiyan 3 Goku at 55% level 10 links against the God of the Tushkin event or events. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.